After the Civil War, African Americans had their freedom, but not much else. In the South, many of them stayed in the same area, even in the same cabins, where they had lived as enslaved people. Now there was a new system. They worked for shares of the crops they tended. Around the same time, whites who didn't own land were also pushed into sharecropping. When do you work on the farm? All the time. Inside the barn, you will find their tip holes, okay? Uh, and they, they are typically, you had somebody was standing one foot on one pole, one, so you hung from the top down, and you're reaching down to pick up the stick from the person down there, and then you handed it up. You learn early to, to help out, and Daddy was one of those that he was going to show you how, and then he expected you to do it. I was driving a tractor when I was seven years old. It was hard. You couldn't hardly make a living. And you have one bad year, and basically, you just never got caught up. My mother was so precious, and my father died and left 12 children in the house. When I look out there, I, in my mind, I see my mother, I could see my mother ply the mule all day. The cotton was gold. Everybody who affiliated with the cotton got rich, except for the person that did all the hard work. We were sharecroppers, and we picked the cotton. We have good years picking cotton, but we never could break even or make money. Don't it dare to look lonesome when that evening sun goes down just about this dark.